What's up, fellow Earthlings? What's up, Richard? What's up? Yeah, yeah. So we're out in Deltona right now. I'm about to clean out a full house. We're waiting for the customer. And uh, yeah, I actually forgot I had a job this morning. That's pretty bad, huh? And uh, Richard's got a tip of the day for you guys. Tip us or you're gay. <laughs> That's the tip of the day. Tip us or be gay. Listen, junk removal companies deserve tips just as much as all the other services out there. We are essential. Where there are people, there is junk. And my phone's about to die. Okay, okay, let me show you what we got going on today. I'm breaking down this bed here. This bed with some drawers and uh, breaking it down flat. Just to make sure we can fit everything. All right, so we took the bed out of here, and we still have that mattress and the drawers out of it, out of the bottom of the bed here. TV, TV stand, got a futon, a couple of chairs, cushions, speaker and lamp over here. Got us an entertainment center, and two couches to get out of here. We got a bed, end table, some miscellaneous junk, and uh, some stuff in the garage here. That table. And some miscellaneous out here. I don't know exactly what's going yet, but I'll get it figured out just soon enough. Room number one is done. Cleared out. Room number two complete. Guys, look at this beautiful picture in the house hanging up on the wall. <laughs> there he is! That's a beautiful picture. <laughs> When was the last time any of you guys watched a VHS? Look at this, they got Jurassic Park, and we got Training Day, The Fifth Element, Apollo 13. Yeah, these are some classics here. 50 bucks, who wants them all? 50 bucks. <laughs> these are a dime a dozen, huh? Leave a comment down below if you get a whole shitload of VHS tapes in your junk removals.
You know what time it is. Slow mo time. Okay, Richard, $2 bet you won't break all four of those pieces of glass. With one pebble. With one pebble. Do you think he's gonna do it, guys? Okay, so Richard's got a theory. The first one only broke one piece of glass. What's so, your theory? Three pebbles, three pieces of glass. Makes sense. Let's see, guys. Okay, so back to work. We're gonna get these chairs out of here. Get that table out of here. That what? The uh, bookshelves there. We get those. Okay, so just those two chairs and that table. Got a little small pile of junk, which we haven't touched yet. But there's not much. We got the. The mattress box spring frame, end table, speakers, and uh, some miscellaneous. I guess we got some clothes in here. Gotta get out. I'm not sure. Stay tuned. So we followed Ben there, dumped that, and uh, you know, we're here at the transfer station behind them in line. This guy's out here getting uh, getting his tarp off with bungees and climbing on top of the dumpster. and doing all that craziness. Let me show you what Richard's done. Oh, he are, he's already done. All Richard had to do was push this little button right here. Open tarp, closed tarp. Isn't that amazing, guys? How easy was that, Richard? A lot easier than that. Yeah. And he was staring at me, recording him like, dude, stop making fun of me. Huh? <laughs> So this guy's still working. He's folding his tarp up now. I mean, that's cool. He's folding it up nice and everything, but whew, it takes forever. All you gotta do is spend $700 on an electric tarp system like that, and uh, you're all good. And I know it's a big company. They can afford that shit. But dang, he just took like 10 minutes to do that. Yeah, and he's like, yeah, man. Stop recording me, bro. That's a cool toolbox you got there. So we're back and we've been loading this second container here. We're almost done with it actually. And uh, this is the only piece I recorded. Look at Richard. He looks like Bill Nye the science guy, huh? Like extra shiny version. You know when you go play Pokemon and you catch a shiny Pokemon? That's a shiny Richard. So this is what we got left here. This stuff, we're gonna leave the appliances. Um, leave that little pile there in the corner and those two things with the chemicals we're not taking and we'll just kind of clean up a little bit but uh yeah it looks like another half load to a three-quarter load by the time we're done and we only got paid for one load so don't make that mistake guys and guess what guys the uh the been there been there dump that they're literally right behind us in line again it's freaking crazy here check this out Us. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're at the landfill. This guy's about to dump all his junk here. And uh, because I don't think I can open the door up. Let's see. Oh, just barely, bro. That was crazy. Okay. So we got been there, dump that. What's up, man? Look at Kanezo. That's a sexy alien. Them, them dumpsters can hold a lot right there. 
back of my truck can hold a lot too. What's up, bro? You waiting for me? Okay, we almost in the air. Look, guys, I'm just walking around the truck pushing the button. Pretty cool. Coolest guy in the world right there. Yeah. I love when he's here at the dump. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>